Now this isn't Ragnarok. I don't qualify for it yet, but this is Schleipnir. I think I said that right. This is like a step down from Ragnarok, but it's still eight ounces of super hot chocolate. In Norse mythology, Sleipnir is the eight-legged horse of Odin. Therefore, there are eight legs in this chocolate bar. The rules are no drink at all for the entire challenge. You got two minutes to eat each of Sleipnir's legs. You may not start the next leg until that time is up. Timer. Complete all eight legs. Bar is handcrafted from delicious dark chocolate and soft toffee spice with bits of ghost pepper and Carolina Reapers. Guaranteed to please the craziest chili heads and strike fear in everyone else. So this is not nearly as hard as Ragnarok. However, there's no point in me trying to get to the point where I can eat Ragnarok if I can't eat eight ounces of super hot chocolate. So I'm going to do this challenge first. Here we go. Of course, the air conditioning kicked back on. It's like a giant Kit Kat. Hopefully no one shows up while I'm trying to do this. Open it cleanly. Okay, timer back there. And I guess the two minutes starts after I finish the first one. But I'll go ahead and start the timer so that way I can do cut. And y'all will see that the timestamp is continuous, although this will go unedited on YouTube anyway. Oh, it breaks really easy. Oh, bro, what the hell? Okay, I'm gonna have to open this up a little bit. This has got like caramel in the middle. So I guess this is like super hot caramel in the middle of this one. Oh, and it just breaks apart super easy. So the legs aren't gonna be like uniform. Look when I tried to break the leg off of it. Look what it did, like collapsed. Okay, so we may not be able to eat even legs each time because they're not gonna break even, but that's okay, we'll do our best. Okay, starting timer. I guess I'm gonna go for a first leg here. Now it says on the website, this is their easiest challenge. Oh, so 105, so 305 before we do the next leg. On their website, they said, this is the easiest challenge. And after that first leg, I have to agree. I'm not gonna have any trouble with the heat on this. It's just gonna be a question of, can I put away this much chocolate? Hold this on the edge too, so I don't melt it. Never a dull moment around here. <sighs> so how y'all doing? Good. 
feel free to uh, leave stuff in the comments. I don't know, whatever you want. Now I did get one of their hotter challenges. I got one called Insanity, which is um, super hot chocolate skulls. And I'll do that one at a later date. So if you're not a subscriber, jump on there because that one's gonna be way harder. I think the hottest skull in that challenge, one little skull like this is equal to eight Carolina Reapers. This one is supposed to be like eating four Reapers and four ghosts, I think. I don't know, whatever. Hopefully they'll get hotter as you go down the bar. Although, if that was the case, depending on where you started the bar, it could be easier or harder. <laughs> 10 seconds. Man, this thing's just falling apart. It's 70% uh, dark chocolate with like a toffee caramel center. And that's where all the Reaper and the Ghost is, is in the gooey center. All right, it's been two minutes. So 5.57 before I can do the next one. I made sure too, that I didn't really do any, anything crazy hot in the last week or two, so that this challenge could be as difficult as possible, all things considered. And I'm making sure to keep the whole bar on camera the entire time. Not like you switch out an eight ounce dark chocolate bar filled with caramel for something else. It's a pretty unique piece of confectionery. I didn't check the memory on my phone before I started this. Hopefully it won't run out. <laughs> this is a long challenge. Just making sure no customers are coming in the store. I have the door locked and I have to be back in five minutes on there, but still rude to be standing here doing a challenge if there's a customer at the door. Okie dokie. Gooey. Okay. Leg three. Six forty.
So far, this is just good. <laughs> for leg number four. Burn is so pointless on this one. It's really, unless something changes in the next four bars, this is not a difficult challenge at all. All right, 840. I'm getting worried about this thing melting. I'm gonna keep it on plate from here on out. <sighs> Alright, 11.30 for the next leg. these other legs already like free break them I right, this will be that much easier to oh uh, it's like a leg and a half oh well all right there's 1040 let me just do this do a little extra Team 33.
I eat all the chocolate. I should have gotten a knife. This would be a lot easier. Oh, this is getting more melty by the second. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Gonna leave this here. Probably should have just bitten each leg off. Oh well. Too late now. If you saw this video first on somewhere other than YouTube, you'll understand why I did the cuts. The afterburn on something that's not that challenging is so boring. Like at least if something is really difficult, the afterburn will essentially make it to where like you're just trying not to puke during each break. And this is okay, just hurry up with the time so I can finish. Okay. So 1615 for the next leg. Crazy that this is a 20 minute challenge. Oh, oh good, not here. All right, I'm just gonna bite this leg off on the next one because it's like, this is just breaking apart and making a huge mess and fingers are all sticky. Fortunately, I'm wearing gloves. And they said to qualify for Ragnarok, they have like three different challenges. I think it's two Nemesis bars, 64 Reapers fresh, or one of their other challenges. So I don't know, I guess after I do this one, which really isn't hard, and then I'll try the Insanity one next. And then if both of those go well, then I'll order whichever the other bar is that qualifies. Uh. What was it? I think it was 1615. Having ADD and doing marathon challenges do not go together. All right, there you go. Of course, this isn't even work.
1702. <sighs> okay, so this one's definitely in the bag. So that's the good news is I can do an eight ounce chocolate challenge when it's normal. That's the biggest thing I was worried about. I've never tried to do an eight ounce chocolate before, bar before and this thing is a monster. Now that I know I can do it, now I need to keep going and so I can qualify and try to do Ragnarok, which I'm honestly not looking forward to. It's gonna be a puke fiesta for sure. It's just gonna be a matter of, it's not gonna be a question of can I get all the way through the bar. If it's the same size as this, there's no way. It's just gonna be a question of how many legs can I eat before I throw up? So I definitely won't be doing that one at the shop because I don't need to be puking all over the floor in here while uh, I get customers waiting or something. Oh crap. What was it? 17.02. Okay, so I got one more minute. <sighs> this challenge, if like if you were younger and you wanted to do this challenge, you're good. This is probably easier than the one chip. Um, I'm trying to think what else I could compare it to. This would probably be on par with Solar Flare. The Sunflower Seed Challenge. All right, let's finish this off. And get my last two minutes in and call it quits. Or actually, call it success. All right, I think it was 1705, so 1905, here we go. I know some of y'all jackasses will be like, oh, there's still some on the plate. <sighs> 20 even. So at 22, we're done. I'm excited. Not because I finished the challenge, I'm excited because now I know I can eat an eight ounce chocolate bar. And there are quite a few really stupid uh, chocolate bars. There's a uh, Moab, I think is what it's called, and Nemesis and Ragnarok. So now I know I have the capability to knock out eight ounces of chocolate. And it's just gonna be a question of how hot are they and can I hang? It's exciting though. I'm staying on camera. I'm just getting a paper towel. There you go. Still on camera. Okay. Well, that went well. Didn't have a customer bang on the door and finish the challenge. And I'm not gonna throw up. That's a good challenge day right there. 25 minute video though, good grief. Editing this down to a minute and a half is gonna be fun. Oh well, we're doing cuts for sure on the, on the uh, TikTok and Instagram versions. And if anybody don't believe it's real, they can watch it on YouTube, unedited. All 25 freaking minutes that Y'all don't ever watch because nobody likes my long form videos. <laughs> All right, there it is, 22, done. 
Next up will be Insanity. I'm not sure when I'll do that. First chance I get. Uh, I actually know. Before that, I'm going to... Uh, the Gummy Bear guy is sending me his new Gummy Wing Challenge. He has a wing challenge he's doing uh, that's going to be like six gummies that are the actual size of chicken wings. And it's going to be escalating levels of heat um, from Serrano up to 16 million Scoville. Well, the wing isn't 16 million, but he's putting 16 million capsaicin in it. So it's going to be nasty. So we'll see how that one does. That one should be here hopefully this week. If not, next week. I'll do it before Christmas for sure. All right. That was fun. No reaction. <laughs>